Whether you install WordPress locally or via the hosting provider, you'll get this screen after completing the installation and logging in as a site administrator. This is what the WordPress dashboard looks like. Don't get scared by the number of different sections here. Everything is easier than it looks, and I'll walk you step by step through the whole process of setting up your website. By default, WordPress has only the blogging functionality, but you can easily extend it by installing various plugins available for WordPress. So, the starting point is to install a WordPress plugin that adds directory and marketplace features to your website. In this course, we'll use HivePress, a free, multi-purpose plugin that allows you to create directory and marketplace websites of any type. To install a new plugin, go to the Plugins, Add New section, and type HivePress in the search bar to find the plugin. Then, click on the Install button. Once it's installed, simply proceed by activating it. OK. The next step is to install a WordPress theme that will define the styling and layouts of your website. For the sake of this course, we'll use the Meeting Hive theme. It's a clean and modern WordPress theme for appointment booking websites. And it's fully compatible with the HivePress plugin. To install a WordPress theme, go to the Appearance, Themes page and click Add New. Then, click on the Upload theme button, upload the theme zip file and proceed with the installation. Once you activate the theme, you'll get a suggestion to install the recommended plugins. It's crucial to install all of them to get all the necessary functionality for building an appointment booking platform. Simply click on the recommended plugins link and proceed by installing and activating them. After installing the theme, you can import the demo content, but in this course I'll skip this and start from scratch to show how to set everything up step by step. If you want to start with existing content, I'll leave a link to the demo import instructions in the video description, as well as a link to the Meeting Hive theme. Also, please note that you have to set the license key for the Meeting Hive theme in order to everything functions correctly and to receive updates. To do that, go to the HivePress Settings section, Integrations tab, and set your license key. Now, let's extend the website functionality using HivePress extensions. At this point, you should have the HivePress plugin and the Meeting Hive theme installed. However, depending on your website niche and requirements, you may want to extend its functionality. You can easily do this by installing HivePress extensions. Simply go to the HivePress extensions section. This is a list of the available HivePress extensions that you can purchase or install for free. To install an extension, simply click on the Install button and activate the extension once it's installed. Then, you can follow the same steps for other extensions you want to install. Let's move to the next video where I'll show you how to add listing categories and custom listing fields. See you in a minute!